This is Mr. Jerdy, and I'm back. It's Southwest 212. Let's get 100 likes. All right, so Grandma found a tree, seedling growing in her yard many years ago. She recorded its height over the years and made this graph. Nice job, Grandma. Answer the following questions. Let's find the slope and its meaning, the y-intercept its meaning, and then write the equation. So when you got a graph, do the y-intercept first. Just go to the y-axis right there and see where it hits. You can't quite tell on this graph what it is, but this nice coordinate point here tells us that it hits at 3, exactly. So I'm going to write a 3 in here. And we're going to write in the meaning for what that means. At time 0, why is it 3? It means that's when grandma... started recording. Okay, we've got that. Now I need to find the slope on here. I need to find my rise and my run. I'm actually going to use these coordinate points to help me do that. It started over here at 0 and went over all the way to, I can see right here in the coordinate point, 22. So it ran 22 and it rose um, from 3 to 36. Somebody will be ready with a calculator for me because I will need that number. Okay, um, so from 3 to 36, it went up 33. So now we're going to write in our slope there. It's going to be rise over run. Somebody divide that for me. I'm going to come back to that. And we're going to write in what that would mean. That's how many feet it grows per year. So that's the feet per year. How many feet per year is that exactly when somebody divided, Tristan? 1.5. So that is 1.5 feet per year. Now we can write our equation. Y equals 1.5x plus 3. Aren't grandmas the best? Let's get 100 likes.